so thick. Hold your head up here. Stop it, Shelby. Shelby. Melin. Oh, honey. I'll go get the juice. Truly, I've got some candy in my purse. I've got to catch them right here. Shelby, we're getting you some juice. Leave me alone. Here. Oh, honey, have a peppermint. Come here. I got the juice. Here. Shelby, you need some juice. Drink, honey. Drink some juice. Honey, drink the juice. No, no. Stop it. I have candy in my purse. You didn't bring your purse, honey. Here, have another sip. It's not any wonder with all this wedding nonsense and running around. It's serious, mate. I should not call a doctor or something. No, no. Shelby's a diabetic. She's just got a little too much insulin, that's all. She'll be fine if we can get something into her. Drink some more, Shelby. I'm going to leave if you don't leave me alone. I'd love to see you try. Shelby, cooperate. Drink, honey. There we go. That's a start. That one hit her quick. What if this happened when she was driving a car? She could get hurt. You've known Shelby as long as I have. You know, I have to let her be strong. She doesn't seem to be down too deep. Talk to her, Shelby. No. That's good enough. <laughs> She's been so upset lately. She and Jackson have been going round and round. Dr. Mishu told them at the last appointment, children are not possible. It wasn't the easiest thing in the world to sit there and watch your child talk right. Don't talk about me like I'm not here. There, she's making some sense. This one wasn't bad at all, but I think we could use a little more juice. Can I do something? Should I? Uh... No, no, Shelby. We'll be fine in just a minute. Don't fuss over her. Normality is very important to Shelby. I'm sorry to hear about the children, Parker Lynn. I know. She feels Jackson might be throwing away his chance for children. They've discussed it, and he seems to have taken it all right. Shelby's the one that's pushing the issue. He's crazy about her. He said, shut up, don't be stupid. There's plenty of kids out there that need good homes. We'll adopt 10 of them, we'll buy them if we have to. Jackson sounds like good people to me. I knew right then and there if he was dumb enough to spend the rest of his life with me, then I'm dumb enough to marry him. 